Reading Passage Three. The Family Carnival is an annual event organized to raise funds for Club Rainbow. This charity organization reaches out to children with illnesses. My parents help out at the club, and had offered to help sell coupons for the carnival. Can I help too? I asked my parents excitedly. You can help as long as you speak politely. My father reminded me. One day, my parents and I went to sell the coupons. I went up to people walking past and asked them politely, "Would you like to buy coupons for the carnival?" I was delighted when people supported us and promised to visit the carnival. Reading passage three. Pronunciation. Pay attention to the pronunciation of long-sounding words or long phrases. At the same time, pay attention to the articulation. Make sure you articulate them clearly. For example, the family carnival annual event. Organized to raise funds for Club Rainbow Charity Charity Organization Organization. In the word organization, we stress on Z organization. Riches illnesses illness. Illnesses, because the word illness end with s s, so when you pronounce the plural form, when you add the e s, you had to pronounce it as illnesses. Parents, my parents, at the club, at the club, had offered, had offered. To help sell coupons, to help sell coupons, to help sell coupons for the carnival, to help sell coupons for the carnival, carnival, the carnival. Excitedly, I asked my parents. Excitedly, excitedly. As long as you speak politely. Politely, speak politely. As long as you speak politely, reminded me. My father reminded me. One day, my parents and I went to sell the coupons. One day, my parents and I went to sell the coupons. Walking past. Walking past, delighted, delighted. I was delighted. People, people, support, supported, supported, supported us, supported us, and promised. When people supported us and promised to visit, promised to visit, promised to visit the carnival, I was delighted when people supported us and promised to visit the carnival. Reading passage three. Now listen. For the pitch, and tone, and expressiveness, also listen for the fluency and rhythm. What do we mean by pitch and tone? Listen to the speed. Is it fast or slow? Listen to the volume. Is it loud 
or soft? Is it high or low pitch? To express a variation in the emotions and feelings of the characters in the story. For example, like this. The family carnival is an annual event organized to raise funds for Club Rainbow. This charity organization reaches out to children with illnesses. My parents helped out at the club and had offered to help sell coupons for the carnival. Can I help too? I asked my parents excitedly. Can I help too? Now, in this dialogue, you must be able to reach it in with the pitch and tone to express the emotion of excitement. The excitement of being able to help your parents sell coupons at the carnival. You can help as long as you speak politely, my father reminded me. So in this dialogue, father should be speaking it in a very serious tone. As selling carnival, so as selling car coupons at a carnival involve patience, politeness, and you'll be expected to interact with the public. So your father will expect you, the child, to be able to approach donors and ask for donation politely. And you are representing the charity organization. And you are actually persuading for donation, encouraging donation. So you have to sound serious and convincing. So over here, my father reminded me, your father should speak with a serious, slow tone and a low pitch. Now the last paragraph. One day, my parents and I went to sell the coupons. I went up to people walking past and asked them politely, Would you like to buy coupons for the carnival? I was delighted when people supported us and promised to visit the carnival. Now in the last paragraph, you must read it such that you show your awareness of the purpose. The purpose is to sell coupons for the, can for the charity organization so that people will be able to come to the carnival and use the coupons for games or for food. So your purpose here is to persuade people to buy the coupons and to visit the carnival. And you must also reach it such that you show an understanding and awareness of the context. What is the context? The context is you are persuading people to, to buy the coupons and use the coupons at the carnival. So you should be reading it with a persuasive tone or an encouraging tone. Last but not the least, you should read the last paragraph to show an awareness of the audience. So who are your audience? You are actually, the audience is actually the generous people who are likely to, who are likely to purchase your coupons and then later on visit the carnival and use the coupons at the carnival. So your audience